Greetings everyone, welcome back to yet another game commentary video with me, Kemze and Lynn. And today we shall be chattering about Far Cry New Dawn as uh, we have finished it. But before we start, please do lean back and lay down and grab something to eat and drink as we shall be sharing some opinions, uh, hints, tips, tricks, whatever. And uh, if you have any as well, feel free to drop down in the comments below. Or, as always, add me on Steam, and we shall have a chit chat about it. But, um, well, I gotta say, this game, I mean, it's cool. This was basically, it should have been a DLC, not just a, how should I say? Um, not a standalone game. Well, not really that long. To be fair, like, come on, all the other Far Cry's sure. have been far too longer. This was a bit... Sure, like how many missions we have like had uh, 22 story missions like that was not too many even though I did like them there's no um, uh, judging there nor am I just judging this you know, game and all that but it's just thinking like okay the game could have been maybe just DLC or a bit more longer I don't know they just could have um, how should I say uh, I don't know Gave it a bit more side stories as well, not side stories, as in a bit of going left and right instead of straightforward. Well, we did go through that as well, but I felt like it was too short, let's say that. Because it is shorter. Yeah. The map is half. Yeah, it is. The original fifth game. Yeah, it is. Like, we didn't see all the landscape, even though the short, it has been blown up. It would be amazing to see the other areas, like... Even it is blown up. Yeah, because the northern side seems shorter. I remember there were like four, no, six islands. We had one big one down below, and then far right, there is also the big one, which is partly also blown up. And then up north, that's also blown up. And now I cannot obviously see there's a lot of atomic bullshit there as well by the map. Like, you can see those green lines and all. But, you know, it would be amazing if we had some missions there to do. Like, hey, we are in a land that is destroyed and. We are supposed to, you know, bring them back to life. All we did is just bring these, this... All what we did is genocide even more people. Yeah, and bring back prosperity alive. Even though it was quite fun, like, it was amazing to bring back prosperity, seeing those upgrades. Like, it's something really unique. It gives you some kind of an RTS kind of... Um, Jenna, and don't forget mentioning it's just showing how far you're progressing. It's really nice. Like it does feel rewarding and all as well when you always finish these kind of things as well. In my opinion. Then, um, well, what else do I gotta say? I don't know. Um, the game felt nice, and it was a little bit fantastic, uh, fantasy-like. Hey, okay, it's nice. In the end, it's a game. It was fun. I would recommend it to everyone, and get your ass over here. I need your help. There was a lot of nice side stories, even though maybe they should have, how should I say, attached them to the main one. Could be nicer too. Forcing people to do it. Well, not forcing, maybe like doing it, and then you'll get some story wise as well from it. I don't know. Maybe something like that. Maybe more nicer. Let's just say, in all in all, that it could have been. Um, Great to oh, you let us outside. Yeah, why not? I don't know. Well, it could be nicer to you know. Stop it. <laughs> to um, all in all, expand the story more because I felt like it's too short. It's been amazing to learn how they've gone up to their dad's path because you know they've gone to their dad's path. They regret it a lot, but why have they done this? There must be a reason. Is it only just because of their mom? Did they feel like bad or something? Why? I don't know. But, okay. Even though the story was perfect, it was nice, it's just. Could mean elaborated, let's say that. Furthermore. Possibly. Yeah. What? Didn't you like the snotty daddy? I found him. Uh, as a villain like character, he was great. Now that he just stopped, like he was like regretting and all that, he then started to know, like, okay. I gotta stop doing this and all that because I also got a son and all to ca take care of my fa uh, my son and all. He was really like a religious man and 
I mean, basically, for all his slaughter, all that blowing up and all that, he just paid for this with this, his son's death. That's my opinion. Like, again, so, such a father, such a son. So... That's why I delivered what he asked. Nah, 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 nah. You shouldn't have done that. You shouldn't have let him suffer. He deserved to that have that kind of... How should I say? Um... Suffering, go through the pain because you know many people also lost a lot of loves, loved ones, and all that. We're the survivors of that entire genocide from him. So what about showing mercy? He doesn't deserve that. He already had that. <laughs> I mean, come on, he has that mercy. He is free, he's roaming around, he is eating, and all that. So, you should yeah, just but that's not what he wants. Well, he wants to be released, but. Yeah, I released them all right. Yeah, yeah, you Off did. a cliff. <laughs> Off a cliff. <laughs> Still, he didn't deserve that. But then again, it was quite interesting to see how he transformed from Far Cry 5 to be such a villain of a man now to be a... I don't know. Well, I could call it a hippie, but I find it a bit offensive. But then again, he was kind of a peaceful and... Um, I don't know. Some he kind became of like, a hermit. I wouldn't call it a hermit, I would call it a monk or something, or... I don't well, know. Well, he did but... in, uh, go in isolation, that's what hermits do. Yeah, true. Well, monks do that as well. They're always at the temple and all, they're busy with their abilities, they're cultivating and all that. You can call him a monk, or uh, yeah, Shaolin monk, I don't know, a Sufite or something, I don't know. I'm a... still gonna call him Snotty Daddy. Yeah, he is a Snotty Daddy, that's true. But I don't know, <laughs> he could be anything. He... Yeah, he's still a snotty daddy, and his <laughs> snotty son died like that. So as I said, such a mo uh, such a son, uh, such a father. Uh, yeah, and it was kind of cool that we were also able to craft our own weapons and all. But eh, I just didn't like the that we always had to get better weapons to kill those enemies. It was a bit eh, didn't like it. <laughs> That's yeah. why it's based on the RT. I mean RPG system. Yeah. But then again, when you had the previous Far Cry 5, there we just killed, you know, easily. Then yeah, well, now we have uber uber powers. Yeah. But then again, that's why I said in the beginning, it was almost quite fantasy-like, because his son just transformed into a, what, a werewolf, just as I said? A yeti. A yeti. A fucking black yeti. Like, what the hell? But Cocaine then again, one hell of a truck. Yeah, I mean, actually, it's strange. Why have we not transformed into a bloody yeti like a fucking? I don't know. Didn't you hear what the snotty father said? He had darkness in his soul or some bullshit. Yeah. Oh well. Guess we did not. We have a pure, kind heart. Yeah, and we uh b are blessed <laughs> by the gods and all. Oh yeah, definitely. Well, for the house, I don't really have much to say apart from that. You know, it was quite amazing. Just I think that could be more elaborated, a bit more things attached to it, the more story-wise and more upgrades. Like we conquered outposts too. But that was strange that we couldn't do anything apart from you know, how uh, should I say? Uh, they were basically just for material. Yeah. But it could be nicer to be elaborated. It has a lot of potential stories and all that that can be added through it as well. Again, I'm not saying it's a bad game, no. I'm merely saying it could be elaborated, it could be given more story and interest into it. More plots, more things, just more. Because again, it felt short, simple as done. I'm not gonna keep um, beating around the bush, that's it. But for the else, I, I don't really have much else to say. What about you? I think it was fine. Although, if you're gonna recommend this game, I would recommend first playing the fifth game. Yeah, that's for sure. You really have to go through the fifth one first, because there's a lot of yeah. story behind this, so... Again, yeah, this, because this, this actually feels like a just DLC. Yeah, that's why I said it couldn't have been better if it was a, just a DLC for the Far Cry 5. So, yeah. But I guess they had to do something before they released the six. Yeah, that's true. I mean, we shall see how the sixth one is, even though it's really already getting my interest, so we shall see. I only watched some preview trailer. Yep. So, that looked really interesting. Yep. 
We shall see how it will fare, boy. Ow. Wait, why can I not? I cannot shoot down that lamp. Oh well. But then again, it's cool. realism. Yeah, it is. Well, this game far from realism. Jesus. But anyway, um, yeah, that's the point. I was trying to shoot that lamp, but it didn't die. It does have a little bit of realism kind of aspect, but nah. but then again, um, I will give this game a score of, uh, from a skill one till ten. Um, uh, it's difficult to give. I think I'll just give it a nine. Basically because it couldn't be elaborated, even though, okay, it's, as I said, it has everything. It's just couldn't be more elaborated, more adventure and all that would be better. But that's my opinion again. What I agree see? with it. I also agree it's a 9 out of 10. Yeah. But it's not bad from far. Yeah. yeah. It looks visually LP appealing. It is appealing for sure. Well, um... That's it then, so I hope you guys agreed with us. If you don't, then feel free to drop down in the comments box below why, what and where. And uh, we can have a chit chat about it. You can always do that also with me on Steam. But um, this shall be it for now. So we shall see you guys in our next video.